<laughs> okay, so I'm going to try this one today, okay? So in this tube, we have got three different colour balls, okay? We have got a green ball, a yellow ball, and a red ball, okay? So it's a really easy trick. All you've got to do is remember the order of the different colours, okay? So we've got the colour green, we've got the colour yellow, and we have got the colour red. Okay, can anybody remember the order? Green, yellow, red. Green, yellow, red. So this way it gets a little bit confusing, okay? I'm not sure why this happens, but well, we're going to give it another go, okay? So what do the colours remind you of anyway? Traffic lights, okay. So what does, what does green mean? Go. What does yellow mean? Caution. Caution, I'll get ready, yeah. And what does red mean? Stop. Stop. <laughs> kind of, in Otley it kind of means, kind of means go in Otley. Oh, okay. um, I found that out on the way through here today. Okay. Uh, so what was the order? What colour does green mean? It should have been green, yellow, red. Oh. Right, okay, so what we're going to have to do, we're going to have to get rid of the red ball, okay? We've got a little box over here, we're going to put the red ball into the box. And we're just going to use two different colours. So we've got the green and the yellow. So the green ball and the yellow ball. Okay, so what was the order? Green and yellow. And the red ball's right over here. Yeah. Oh. Oh, well it was. It was over there a second ago. Um, Okay, so I've only been doing magic for around about five years, okay? It was actually a good friend of mine called James who got me into magic in the first place. He always used to do an amazing trick with a, with a big basketball and a long, sharp needle. He used to get the needle and push it through the basketball, okay? And put it out the other side and I had no idea how he could ever do it, okay? So I thought, I've got to learn that trick, so I'm going to do it with a balloon. Okay, so we've got a balloon here, and we have got a really sharp needle. So what will happen if I put the needle into the balloon? Can anyone tell me? It will normally burst, okay? So we'll give, we'll give it a go, okay? Are you sure you want to see this? Okay. I forgot to tell you that this trick it can go wrong, okay? So is anyone is anyone scared of balloons popping? No, you're all okay, you are all okay if it goes wrong. I dare you to. You dare me to pop it? Right, okay. Right. I'm I'm not joking, it can go wrong. Okay. <laughs> Where you've got to pray, okay? Um, right. So that's the hard bit over with, okay? The even harder bit's getting it all the way through. Alright. What? No, And believe it or not, the even harder bit's getting it all the way out without it popping or going down. Okay, so we'll give we'll give it a go, okay? So, um, my friend James, I was saying at the beginning that he used to do the same trick with the basketball. And when he'd done this trick, I mean, it always used to baffle me, but he used to be able to bounce it about like this, okay? And it would never ever go down. Oh, it only goes down if you use the wrong end of the needle. Sorry about that. <laughs> okay, can I borrow a volunteer for a card trick? Is that okay? Just someone to come and help me out? Is that okay? Absolutely anybody will do. Any volunteers? Just one single person? 
It doesn't matter who, just one single person. Brilliant. Well volunteered, thank you. Okay, so all I'm going to do is riffle down the pack and I want you to call stuff on any card you want. Okay. Okay, if you can take that card, have a look. You can show the whole audience that card if that's okay. Well, don't tell me what card you picked, all right? You're working in Spain with it next week. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. Okay. Brilliant. I mean, I could just drop a card in there. <coughs> okay, we're going to find a card a completely different way, okay? Um, I, um, from my best cheating scene in high school, believe it or not, was um, art, okay? So I've drawn a pack of playing cards. Okay. So can you see that again? So what we're going to do, we're going to... Um, Show you there, okay? You all see that, okay? So, what we're going to do, we're going to add a little bit of matching. Okay, so what's the card you picked? There you go. There we go, you can keep that there. Thank you. Thank you. Well, thanks for your help. You're welcome. Okay, so we need one more volunteer if that's okay. Um, are you happy helping me? Is that alright? So we've got a bag over here we've got loads of different newspaper clips, okay? And the reason why I do this is because I like to, um, if I see any good news or any happy news or even like a funny joke, I cut it out and store it as a memory, okay? So it's kind of like a memory box, okay? So when I get a few together, I put, I put them all into one area, one box, store them, and in a few years' time I look back and think, oh, that happened, oh, that was funny, that, that kind of thing, okay? Okay, so all the memories are all now together, okay? But with a bit of magic, all the memories go into one place.